Oregon's entire congressional delegation voted Wednesday against beginning the process to impeach President Trump. Texas Democrat Al Green introduced articles of impeachment to the U.S. House of Representatives Wednesday, saying Trump should be ousted for inciting hate and hostility and tarnishing the majesty and dignity of the presidency. Green used a Byzantine procedural move to force a vote. It was doomed from the start. Republicans control the House. Democratic leaders have warned of pushing too hard and too fast for impeachment. Green's impeachment resolution failed overwhelmingly as 364 members voted to table the question. Even minority leader Nancy Pelosi was among the no votes. But, 58 Democrats split with their leader and voted in favor of beginning debate. Unsurprisingly, Greg Walden, the lone Republican among Oregon's congressional delegation, joined every House Republican in voting to table Green's articles of impeachment. But the state's Democrats, some of whom are vehement Trump critics, also joined Republicans in opposing an impeachment debate. Even Earl Blumenauer, who in response to Trump wrote legislation to make it easier to oust presidents via the 25th Amendment, sided with Republicans on the impeachment vote. In a statement, Blumenauer said that while he thinks Trump is unfit for office, Green's articles of impeachment were ill-conceived and ill-timed and not carefully thought out. When a solid case is developed that would support impeachment action, I will be first in line, Blumenauer said. Rushing ahead without the proper foundation and further politicizing the independent council is not constructive. It's not helpful and does not help us defeat Trump. Blumenauer added, the stakes are too high not do this right. Gordon R. Friedman G. Friedman at Oregonian.com 503-221-8209, at Gordon Friedman.